All right, so anybody can make a good montage. It's really simple. Let's get this ready. I got two clips. I got a pump sound effect. What I do is I normally delete the audio of these clips, right? I hold alt and delete these clips or the audio because I am streaming. I do not want to like have noise in the background. People are going to ruin the clips. There's random people screaming or you know, you never know what's happening. So also I delete the video file of the sound effect. I delete that. I drag this down to make it nice and simple to the point where the sound starts. I also drag the end, make it nice and clean. I know you guys have people in discord, so make sure to delete the sound, please do. Also, it's going to sound nice and crispy. So next we watch the clip, that 20 second clip here. I know the clip as soon as I get the kill. So also, I shorten the front of the clip to the point where I normally grab a wall or I do something crazy or like this. Don't show yourself looking dumb. Like, look at this. Look at this. Homie just missed his shot. Bro. Homie just missed his shot. We going we going to pretend like dude never misses his shot. He, ne he never misses his shot. We're going to go to the point where he grabs the wall again. Boom. 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 Oh my god, oh my god, poops on it. Oh my god, that's crazy. But uh what we're gonna do is we're going to the point where we first see the shot come out because that's when the sound actually like pops up on your screen. We do this one, we just gonna watch it through. Watch it through, watch it through. What which part? Which part where where would you make the clip start? This clip oh damn, he got trashed on. Yo, this dude we watching got trashed on. We're not gonna talk about that. Oh so uh, I think I go to the point. This kill up is kind of hard to decide, but I think I'm going to go to the point where I make the edit, right? We don't want long clips, bro. We don't want to look. We don't want to be looking stupid. You feel? So we just go to that part and boom, done. We find the shot. Where is the shot? Right here. Drag this over. We drag this end part and boom, voila. The sounds are synced. Also, I didn't say this, but if you want to drag the sound files, hold alt and then you can drag them. Drag anything you want. Doesn't matter. We're going to go to presets. I'm going to leave the video down below on how to download the presets. Literally takes like five minutes at tops. And what we're going to do first is we're going to go create an adjustment layer. Right. We're going to drag it all the way to the bottom. We're going to make it one second long. You can tell this by looking at the top. Oh, like right here. If you look, this is one second long. And what we're going to do is we're going to drag it over. So this is the point where the clip like ends, right? There's a little bit of filler. We kind of don't want to show that we want to add like a little transition, a little twisty or whatever, and make it look cool. Also, another thing is at the beginning and the end of the montage, I normally add a 30 second wind up. So that can be like any effect you want. Doesn't really matter. 30 seconds at the beginning and the end. Also, if you didn't realize I'm in the editing tab, just if you didn't know. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to effects, right? And before we do that, my bad, I'm going to move that up there. Hold alt and boom, there's two. We're going to throw this on the bottom. We're going to throw this on the top and boom, you hit enter. It's going to render the files for you. It takes a little while if you have like a whole bunch, but let's see. Boom. And it twists over. You see that little transition? This one not too crazy, but there's actually some crazy ones here. Now I'm about to add the glitch effect to the first one. And we're going to add glitch, whatever. So we just literally drag and drop. It just makes it so easy. Again, push enter to render it. So what we're going to do is we're going to zoom up to the last sound effect, right? Or whatever. And we're going to drop lens distortion. We're going to drop on brightness and yeah, you don't need Sapphire for any of this. It's actually so easy. Don't have to download it. So what I do first is I click this toggle animation. Um, and then we do this curvature. We're going to zoom in our use your arrow keys. I don't have arrow keys on my ducky, so that's a X, but we just moved one keyframe, right? And boom, the shot goes out further. We're going to put the brightness to 100, whatever you would like. See the brightness changes. And then you're going to want to make sure to put a negative number for this because that way it zooms out or zooms in. If you make it a positive number, 
I'll show you guys what happens. It zooms like out if you guys understand. It's kind of weird. But if that's what you want, do you? Then at the end of the clip, since every like ending is always the same after you kill someone, the ending length will always be the same. You can just make sure to end. You can like fade it off at the very end and set it back to zero. All right, so this joint is looking pretty fire now. Okay, okay, okay. But we want to add effect to every single one of our clips. So what we're going to do is we're going to do control C. We're going to go over here, right click, paste attributes. And now this clip is going to have the lightness or brightness and lens distortion on it itself. We're going to go to the start of the sound. We're going to look at like the, yeah, we're going to look at this where you first shoot. Doesn't have to be too perfect. Just try to get as good as possible or close as possible. We're going to type control A. And we're going to drag the very start. If for some reason my joints so laggy and boom to the very start of the keyframe. If we go render this. All right, let's watch it out. See if it worked. And yup, it didn't. And all right, we got a pretty good montage here. There's one more last thing we can do. We can go back to the adjustment layer we grabbed. I'm going to make it the exact size of the montage and we're going to do something simple. It's called luminous trick or whatever it's called. I don't know. I just know how to spell it. And what we're going to do here is we dropped it onto this adjustment layer and we're going to add pretty much color correction. And I just normally like to mess with the saturation. I like my videos kind of to be pretty saturated. I used to even go to 300 where it was really saturated. Look how the brick looks. It's like almost greenish kind of, but I'm going to just leave it for 200 just for this demonstration. Last thing I'm about to do is I'm just adding in some no copyright music. You guys can sync up. I'm pretty sure you guys know how to sync up. Just sync up to this point. Keep it simple for you guys. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make it so we actually hear something and make it shorter and boom, let's play it. Oh my god, he's getting pooped on. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Wow, dude got pooped on. But yeah, if that helped, make sure to subscribe and I'm out. Peace is peace.